when it comes to solar development, CleanMax Solar has been a pioneer. It was the first to introduce Zero Capex built own offer it model for rooftop solar in India. And now we are the number one developer with 25% market share. We built our first grid connected solar farm in Karnataka and ours is the first solar farm in the state for open access consumers. This means industries can directly source energy from our 30 megawatt plant in Tumkur and pay only per unit of power at a discount to the grid tariff. Corporates can now look forward to going 100% solar without any restrictions of roof size or load fluctuations and with zero investment. This can make a big dent in their carbon footprint and can also save anywhere from 15 to 20 percent on their energy costs. Now one important thing about consuming renewable energy through open access power is that in Karnataka and several other states you don't have to consume the power at the same time that it's being generated. So for example, if solar power is mostly being generated in the middle of the day, it doesn't mean it can only substitute power consumption in the middle of, in the, middle of the day or in the same day or even the same month. So what happens is the solar power which is getting injected into the grid is getting metered on a monthly basis and it can be used to offset power consumption in the same month. That consumption could be at a different time of day on a different day of the month and it can even be carried over from one month to the next. And that's very important in ensuring that you can use solar power to offset a large proportion of your, uh, of your power consumption, which may be at different times of the day and different times of the year. Spread across a total area of 170 acres, this solar power plant consists of more than 90,000 polycrystalline solar PV modules. The plant has a fixed structure with seasonal tilt alignment options. The solar power is injected into the main grid at a 66 kVA substation, which is located 5.2 kilometers from Adihalli delivery substation, connected via a double circuit transmission line, which is part of the Clean Max solar plant. The 30 megawatt plant is connected with a dual bay 66 kV KPTCL line with a 16 MVA standby transformer on each bay. So, even in the case of a plant outage, the plant still generates power at 60% capacity, thus maintaining better redundancy. While a rooftop project can be completed in 3 to 4 months, a large solar farm like this one is a one to two year timeline. The key criteria for selecting a good solar farm location are solar radiation in that area, access to an existing grid substation which can accommodate the additional power generation and land and soil which is conducive to construction of a solar plant. This site in Adihalli was quite attractive from all three perspectives. All this is just another step in enabling industries to adopt clean, green and renewable energy by providing them energy that is risk-free, capex-free and cheaper than the grid. So, are you ready to join the solar revolution?